Hello, we are here at the Shield Channel. Uh, we are here with uh, our uh, motorhome, our uh, two uh, e-bikes, and we are uh, here for some bicycling. And as both me and Gru, who is behind the camera, is eager ship spotters, some uh, serious ship spotting. We're going to spend the next couple of days here and uh, we're going to explore a little bit of the area. We are parked just right outside uh, Rendsburg. So hopefully we can show you some of the nicety around here. There are a couple of uh, nice motorhome parking, like this one you see behind me here. Uh, they are typically priced between 14 and 18 euro, as far as we have seen so far. And they all have uh, lovely canal views. You can sit while you're motorhome or inside your motorhome and just enjoy the canal and the ships uh, as the ships goes by. And they all have very good facilities for emptying. This whole big uh, grating here is for emptying your grey water. Here you have your emptying of your black water. And here you have uh, drinking water. Cost a couple of euros to uh, fill up some water. And here you have your payment uh, for your stay. English and German language, they accept Visa card, MasterCard, cash, bananas, you name it. They take it all. And if you see here on a map, just, oh, I love a good map, you know, with a good overview. Uh, we are here now, and, but we are parked with the motorhome uh, on this uh, lot here. And yeah, here is the section of the canal in this area. And this is the town, of course. And here we have the railroad that goes in a cool loop. So it's actually a perfect little spot for uh, train spotting and chip spotting at the same. Uh, it's just, oh, heaven. But there are some very funny ways, uh, or cool ways, or interesting ways uh, to cross the, ch uh, the channel. And we will uh, show you a couple of those now. Of all the way there is the crossing the channel. I'm not quite sure which is my favorite. Uh, they're all pretty cool, I think. But this one is, uh, might be the one that is most weather friendly. I mean, how often can you take your bike uh, legally down an escalator? Yeah, I think this is the technique the locals have. Definitely steeper.
this motor home parking behind me here, I think is the most popular one. Because if you stand here with your cars, you have uh, the view to the, the, the bridge. Just the tall mast on the ship just uh, has a low clearing too. It's a very dramatic effect. And you have this, uh, which I think is the favorite way of crossing the channel. It's this little cable car thingy that goes under the bridge. Well, I will show you on the next clip because I, I don't know <laughs> what the word is. And uh, I don't know the name of it in German. And yeah, I will show you. This has got to be my favorite way of crossing the canal. This little thing that goes underneath the bridge. I don't know. I've never seen anything like this before and I don't even know what the name of it or what to call it. part of this is uh, it's free. This is a transportation uh, Marriott we are not unfamiliar with, ferries. And I think uh, the ferries, or it's obvious that the ferries has uh, not the right of way. You see there's a big boat coming here with some wind turbine blades on it. And we are waiting for him to pass before the ferry goes over. So I think this is, I don't know, it's hard to say which is my favorite one, but well, here we have a three uh, really fun way of crossing the channel. Even the little boats we have to wait for. Now, yes, to the locals, these are just their daily life, their daily commute. But uh, we are running here around like two 12 year old kids. This is so much fun. Through the old town of uh, Rendsburg, you have this blue line that goes through 30 uh, culture points. And it's a nice way to see the town, just follow the blue line, you know, go walk the, walk the line. I think our favorite um, point is this bronze statue of the city here. It's not a statue, it's a model of the old uh, town of Rendsburg. Do you ever wonder where the longest bench in the world is? Do you wonder how long the longest bench in the world is? Well, the longest bench in the world is this one. And how long it is? It goes about 575 meters that way. It's nuts. And it seats about 700 plus people. Boy, these people really need some bench space. So if I decided I wanted to sit down at the other side of the bench, which normally would be like a fairly easy thing to do. But here, it would look like something like this.
Wow, that's a long bench. Oh well. Now I think this is definitely uh, one of my favorite activities here. Just bicycling along uh, the channel on this path that you have on both sides. I read online there is about 300 kilometers of uh, this pass altogether. They pretty much run the whole length of the channel. There are some parts that you have to sort of bicycle in and out again. And as you bicycle along here, these big ships just come passing by. I think I can hear one behind me now. Yeah, there is one coming. Oops. Stay on the path. <laughs> okay, I think we're going to end this video here. Uh, so as usual, thank you very much for watching. Bye for now.